I might as well set up a direct debit with ASOS at this point because I am constantly on their website. Like even though I've not done a haul for them in a long time, I'm always shopping on there. Like it's, I need a website blocker. That's what I need because I can't, I can't stop myself. But the stuff that I picked up today is really nice and I think you guys are gonna love it. We are going to get started with this gorgeous linen co-ord from Pretty Lavish, which is one of the brands that's sold on ASOS. This honestly gives me very like Italian kind of walking around Positano kind of vibes. Like this outfit is made for a holiday, so it needs to be worn somewhere that isn't London, the UK, because it deserves it. It deserves that moment, so hopefully we can go away this year. But this is the top. I think I'll be able to show you this better in person, um, but that's the top, and then it comes with some matching trousers. I am quite sure. I'm 5'3", so I don't know if these are going to be too long. I really hope they're not going to be because I can't be bothered to get these tailored and taken up, but the colour is just dreamy. Like, I love this like natural linen kind of vibe at the moment i think it looks so chic hopefully you can kind of see this outfit i know my head is cropped a little bit i don't have a huge amount of space in the flat um but i actually really love this outfit i think the trousers oh they've got pockets amazing the trousers i mean they are quite long like if i go to my normal height but i think you know on tiptoes if i was wearing heels which is probably what i would wear i actually think they're a really lovely length like all i need is them to just be touching the floor here so i don't think i need like very big heels but I really love this outfit, it's so comfortable. And even though like obviously it's long trousers and a top that's got three quarter length sleeves, it is quite a light fabric. Like I feel like I can wear this on a really hot day and not be boiling. So yeah, we are off to such a good start. Thought I'd show you the other co that I've picked up now. So I'm not gonna lie, I thought this was in black, but it's actually in like a green color. I don't know how well you'll be able to see that on camera, but these are the little shorts. They're in a really cute gingham print. Um, they almost feel like in a, like a waterproof fabric. Like the fabric of these is very interesting. Um, it almost feels like a picnic blanket, but these are the shorts. And then it comes with this little bandeau style top, which I really love. I think it's so cute. I picked the top up in an eight, which I think should be okay. It does look very small though, doesn't it? And then the shorts I got in a six. But I think this is a cute little summer outfit. Again, you know, if someone wants to book a holiday with me, I would happily wear this abroad. So, you know, I'm just putting it out there. I'm just manifesting it. This needs a holiday. This needs to be on a beach. That's what it is. I am fully in love with this. Like I actually think I prefer this to the set before and I didn't think I was going to before, but this is so nice on. And I'm actually thinking now that I'm wearing it, I could wear like a white blazer over the top and a pair of white heels and this can be dressed up. Um, I'm just thinking of all the different ideas. I love this, it's so comfortable. The fabric, whilst it is like, a bit of a, it is a bit of a weird feeling fabric. It's not uncomfortable um, and it doesn't feel sweaty, which is what I was kind of thinking it could be like um, before I tried it on. Um, but yeah, it's really lovely. This top feels very secure as well. Obviously it's got no straps, but the elasticated bit in the back does like, it's quite snug, but like in a nice way. I feel like it's gonna stay up and I'm not gonna have to keep like hoisting it. But yeah, I really, really love this. And the green is so nice. I feel like, it actually looks better green than, than black, because um, I was a bit worried about that as well. But yeah, this is so good. Oh my God, I'm so happy with everything so far. So in my last video, which I think was my styling um, summer outfits one, if you guys haven't watched it yet, please do watch it after this video, because it is a good one. Um, I mentioned that my boyfriend ruined my little bralette, so I actually picked up, this is pretty much a dupe, to be honest. This is a little knitted cream bralette. It's a bit longer than the other one, which I kind of prefer because this looks more like a top. Um, and it's in a really soft fabric. Like, I think this is going to last a long time. I picked this up in an eight, which I think is going to fit nicely. I think it's lovely. Um, and the knit also seems like quite opaque, so I don't think it's going to be see-through. Hopefully it won't anyway. I definitely prefer this to the top that Tommy ruined. Um, it is actually quite a nice fit. The one thing I would say is here, it has a little bit of gapiness, but I think that just, I need to just pull it down. Yeah, that fits a bit better. Um, this is definitely more of like a crop top than a bralette, but I much prefer that. And I think it looks nice with these shorts. Like I could imagine myself wearing this, these shorts, and then a blazer over the top, just as like a casual little look. Um, the top itself, the knit is, 
it's actually quite warm like it's really hot like i've had to close all the windows in the flat so it's a bit of a flat box at the moment so yeah this top is probably quite a good one for like those slightly colder summer days um but yeah i really like it and the fabric feels good as well like it feels nice and stretchy and good quality moving on to a girly little number now i picked up this play suit i'm not gonna lie in my most recent h&m haul i literally picked up this exact play suit not exact but very similar um and i've still got it so what i might do after i've tried it on in this is try on the h&m one and kind of do a comparison because this does look lovely and on the model it looked amazing so i'll see which one i will keep but i do like this it's got a slight like um off white color to it i think on the camera it looks very white but it has got a slight off white um coloring which i quite like i think that's good for someone that's as messy as me hopefully stains and stuff won't show off as easily okay i'm not gonna lie this is a bit of a weird fit i don't know if you can tell but there's like a lot of bunching going on i don't know if it's meant to be ruching but it just doesn't fit properly like this bit here i don't know it just doesn't fit right like that looks better and it looks more like a top and shorts but i don't know i'll show you the back so the back is actually really lovely um, I had a look on the picture on ASOS just to like see um, and yeah it looks a bit, it does look a bit weird actually up close like in, even in the picture so I think this is how it's meant to fit but it's just, it's just a bit of a weird one to be honest like maybe it does look right and I'm overthinking it but I have a feeling it's going to be the H&M one over this even though I do actually prefer the pattern on this I just, I don't know like this bit here is kind of throwing me off i'm not gonna lie this next top i know i'm literally gonna wear throughout the whole of summer like you are gonna see this on me a lot so apologies in advance for that but how nice is this top i feel like this can honestly be dressed up and down so much you can pair it with some like high-waisted shorts and a blazer like denim shorts for a more casual daytime look or you can pair it with some smart trousers or like a nice skirt i love it i think this is so nice i think it's going to fit nicely because it's like adjustable at the front obviously you can just tie the front bit however you want but yeah i have very high hopes for this like i thought this top is a 10 out of 10 i am obsessed with it i feel like i haven't tied it tight enough but you can kind of sense the vibe i also really like it with these shorts these are h&m by the way i will link them down below if i remember if i don't remember let me know in the comments because i do always forget to link things um, but oh my goodness, this is so nice. It's really comfortable. Um, yeah, it's just great. I, have, I honestly have no words because I just, I just love it. I think it's stunning. If you guys are looking for a top like this, then this is the top to go for. Oh, I am obsessed. ASOS. Let me know if you're gonna bring this out in other colours because I need them. I need them in every colour. Like imagine this in a sage green. Oh, stop. Okay. Anyway adorbs love it love it love it love it so i think in an asos haul like maybe two or three months ago i picked up these linen shorts that i have been wearing like all the time like pretty much every single styling video since then has featured those shorts like i wear them constantly and they bought them out in a white color and i just was like yep yeah, I need these I need them in my basket right now exactly the same kind of fabric like everything is exactly the same other than the color these shorts I mean I hope I don't eat my words in the next clip but I think they'll be fine these shorts are some of the best summer shorts you will have in your wardrobe like honestly they're just so versatile they look expensive because they're like a linen style fabric I don't know if they actually are linen but like the these are the moment these are the moment these are everything i love them very much into these shorts so i move the top out of the way so you can actually see them um they are a little bit see-through but not too bad like i am literally wearing a really dark pair of pants so that's why they're see-through um, they fit amazingly the size six was definitely the size to go for they literally fit exactly the same as the pair that i have which is amazing i know for a fact that these are going to be my go-to like now that i've got two colors I will spend my entire summer in these shorts. So thank you ASOS for bringing them out in the white. I love them. I also like them with this little top. Like I know they're not exactly the same fabric, but I feel like they do kind of look like a set. So yeah, I will be styling this up over the weekend because I love this little outfit. Um, and like with a little white blazer, like an all white moment. Oh yes, I'm obsessed. I love the shorts. You need to get the shorts, you need to get the top. We need to, we need, we need to all have this outfit girlies. It's what we need. 
On the day I'm filming this video, I'm actually going to Liverpool tomorrow and I was trying to think of like things I can wear because I don't know how dressy it is. Obviously the football, the England versus, I don't even know what country game is gonna be on tomorrow. So I don't know what the vibe is gonna be, if it's gonna be dressy or a bit more casual. Um, but I picked up this top for that trip. So it's basically like a little open back crop top, but it's got these gold chains, which I think is really nice because if you pair it with like lots of statement gold jewelry, I think this could be quite nice. So, um, Hopefully it won't be too booby because there really is not much fabric going on there. But I think with like some, I don't know, smart trousers or like tailored jeans, this could look really nice. Very much into this top. I'll show you the back. The chains were a bit of a struggle. Like it was a bit of a struggle to get on. Um, I feel like get a friend to help you if you've got a friend there. But once it's on, it's actually so nice. And like what I'm saying with the gold jewelry, with the gold chains, it's a vibe. I'm also, oh, I don't know why I get my, my boyfriend to fake tan me because there's bits, there's patches. Mm, maybe I won't be able to wear this when I go out tomorrow. Maybe I will. I'll just bronze it up. But yeah, it's a really nice top. And um, I think it's going to be quite easy to wash as well because you just like unclip the chains um, and then you can just shove it in the wash. Although I'm thinking the chains are a bit twisted, so maybe they can be a bit longer. Um, but I did kind of struggle to put this on. So yeah, I think this is really cute. I like it with the shorts. It's a very like casual kind of vibe, but this with like a nice pair of trousers, I think will look very like classy, if you get what I mean. Um, so yeah, I really like this. This is different, I like it. I'll show you something with a bit of color now, because I feel like I haven't really been buying many colorful things recently, especially not from ASOS, but this dress was, it was kind of calling to me a little bit. So it's got these, um, like neon flowers. It's like a mix of neon and pastel. Um, and it's just a little slip over like midi, not midi, mini dress. I just thought it was quite sweet. I don't know. I feel like this is going to be one of those that I need to try on to decide if I like it. It did look lovely on the model, but I don't know. These kind of colours on me. I don't know. I am tanned at the moment. I'm fake tanned. So it probably will look better. But yeah, I just thought it was different. I don't have anything like this in my wardrobe. So we'll see what it looks like on. I actually like this way more than I thought I would. Um, gosh, it has such a nice fit. Please don't mind the um, the label. This is new. ASOS never used to do this kind of label. Um, but yeah, this dress is really nice. I like the little slit here. Obviously it does need a bit of a decrease, but I feel like this is one of those dresses that I could genuinely wear out. Like this is so so nice and I also like the fact that it's not like super tight as well like it fits well but it's not tight um because I don't know like, I don't like dresses which are, like real bodycon um I just don't think they really suit me but this is like the perfect fitting dress so I'm I think I might keep this so another option I have for this weekend is this dress so I think it's from oh it's from weekday um I'm just trying to work out how to wear, I think it's like this. So it's basically like this halter neck front um, and then like just a basic midi dress. I think, oh, is that a maxi dress? I can't, I can't tell. Um, I think this is gonna be one of those that when you see it on, you'll see like how it works, but the straps are looking kind of confusing. I think I'm gonna have to look on the website, but it could be a vibe. It could be a vibe, just like a little, a little black dress or like a midi black dress. Is that a thing? It is now. Um, but yeah, I didn't know they sold weekday because weekday is actually part of the H&M brands, I'm pretty sure. So that's exciting. Imagine if they, if they um, start selling like Monkey or like And Other Stories. Oh, that would be nice. I feel bloody sexy in this dress. Oh my goodness. So it is quite long, um, but I am quite short. I'm like five foot three. So it probably would, it's probably meant to be a midi, but it's a bit, of, it's kind of like a mid axi on me. Half a midi, half a maxi. I love this neckline, like the way that the halter bit goes over the straps, it's so nice. And also, it's giving me a bit of a figure, like this is genuinely such a well-made dress. It is stunning. And like I keep saying, I feel like I keep saying this with everything, but it can really be dressed up and dressed down. Um, but, oh my goodness, this is so nice. This haul is literally dangerous because I literally want to keep almost everything at this point. But, can you blame me? Oh! giving me a figure. Oh, I love it. I love, love, love it. One thing I've realized I really don't own enough of is just like really basic kind of 
baggy oversized t-shirt so I picked up this one and I wouldn't normally pick up a green t-shirt but I just really liked this I liked the embroidery on the front so it's from Reclaimed Vintage which I think is an ASOS own brand um, correct me if I'm wrong but yeah I just thought this would kind of work with like the things that I have in my wardrobe because I I like green I like sage green I like emerald green I've never worn anything this green before but I think I might like it on um but yeah just to wear like to the gym or even to wear as like a pajama top or just like to wear on a walk like I need to get out and walk more um because we don't live too far from the Thames so I need to like I don't know go on a little jog or like walk along the Thames to lose some weight because honestly hot girl summer is upon us and the bod is not ready so um yeah this top's just gonna be like a nice casual one which I think I'm gonna love I reckon I'm gonna have this for a long time I really like it the quality is good as well this is such a great like versatile t-shirt and um, it's really baggy like this is a size small um and I love it I love the shape of this it means you can like tuck it in you can probably um oh god I've not tucked that very well but you know what I mean I feel like I will get a lot of like casual use out of this I also really like the color I think the color looks nice with these like light wash shorts so yeah i'm into this and i also like the little rainbow reclaimed yeah this is cool i like this top i feel like i don't normally wear stuff like this i can see my friend ella wearing it because she's like the coolest person that i know um but yeah i like this i actually really like it genuinely it's really it's really not me but i'm here for it this next top looked so good on the model um so i have quite high hopes for it so it's like this Halter neck style, I think, yeah, it's halter neck. And then it's got like this boob bit here and then it's got like a slight cutout and then the rest of the top finishes. So it shows like a tiny little part of your belly. Um, but I just really liked this. I think, like I was saying about one of the tops earlier, it's one of those that you can kind of style up and style down quite easily. Um, but yeah, the fabric feels quite nice. It's like a, um, almost like a soft cotton fabric. So I think this is gonna be nice for the summer, I mean, to be fair, it is black and I don't really like wearing black in the summer because it like absorbs the heat. But yeah, I just, I think it was the model picture that attracted me to this. Like it genuinely looked so nice. So I'm praying it looks really nice on because I don't own many black tops and this would be a nice welcome addition to the wardrobe should it look nice. I'm not gonna lie to you guys, when I tried this on before I'd done the strap up, it actually looked better in my opinion with like, with, well, like when it was strapless. Um, but it still looks nice with the straps on. I really like it. I like the fact that you can tuck like the bottom bit into a pair of like high waisted shorts or jeans or trousers or whatever you want to tuck it into. Um, but yeah, I think it is. I think it's nice. It's different. I don't have anything like this in my wardrobe, so I'm definitely gonna keep it. But I think I'll probably style this up more as like a strapless, um, like day to day. Also, the straps are kind of. Where they're sat, they're a little bit uncomfortable, so yeah, I might just uh, might snip those off, but yeah, other than that, it's a really lovely top, and it's very comfortable and very soft, like this is a nice fabric they've used. I was feeling a little bit girly when I picked out this next dress, I mean girly for me, and um, so it's this like very light camel, I feel like that is the kind of colour, it's like a... Um, a creamy pale brown um, and it's just like a little summer mini dress I just I really like this it looks so I got it in an eight it looks quite big I feel like maybe I could have got away with a six but we'll see what it looks like on I just think this is gonna be a nice easy like throw on dress just for you know little lunch dates in the summer um, or I don't even know you could go out for dinner I think it's just gonna be a nice dress maybe like a beach dress as well just more I think it's giving me more of a casual vibe than like a dressy vibe but we'll see in the next clip asos are really pulling through with the dresses at the minute because this is also really lovely like i love the fit of this it's actually like the most perfect fit like up here it fits almost like it's tailored to me and then i love the way that it like flows out i love the length of it this is absolutely stunning like this dress i honestly could not recommend enough like if you're looking for a really easy summer dress and I think this is the one to go for gosh I love this this honestly might be my favorite thing that I've picked up in this entire video and I really did think it was gonna be but wow I love a little nice surprise like that this is honestly gorgeous and then the final item that I have to show you guys today is this little basic halter neck top I feel like every girl needs to have a white halter neck or like a black halter neck in her wardrobe especially 
for this summer. I feel like halter necks are really doing the most and I think they'll probably stick around for a few summer seasons as well. Um, but yeah, I've, I've been very impressed by the ASOS halter necks so far. So that's why I picked up this one. Um, this is in a size eight. I don't know, I don't know how it's gonna fit. I don't know. I feel like it's one of those where I'm gonna be able to see in the next clip because it is quite like a weird shape. I don't know if you cross it over. Well, you probably could. Maybe it's one of those that you can do like different things with um but we'll see i'll try it on the next clip i feel like this is just going to be a really good little top to just wear under things just like a really basic summer top if you want to elevate from just like a cami or just like a standard vest top i think a halter neck is going to be the way to go it's a good job i like this top because i've honestly already got foundation on it this is tight like this top is hard to get on like i'm kind of worried about taking it off and to be honest i think if I hadn't got foundation on it, I probably wouldn't keep it. But yeah, I don't think ASOS are gonna accept that back, are they? It literally just like went right down my nose. So um, yay, yay for big noses like mine. Um, but yeah, I mean, it's actually not bad. Like the way that it looks is nice. I just think I'd recommend sizing up. So I got this in an eight. I, I normally wear like a six or an eight, but I would definitely size up to a 10 if I was gonna buy this again. Um, it's just, it look, it, it looks nice, but honestly, like, it was a struggle to get on. But, yeah, this is how you wear the halter. Um, when I put it on just over my head, I was like, that looks really baggy. So, yeah, it's definitely like a crossover moment. But, yeah, I'm kind of fuming that I've already got to wash this before I've even worn it out. That's really annoying. Like, imagine, I, honestly, if this happens every single time, I could never wear this top out because I'd constantly get foundation on it. I need to buy one of those, um, we see, I've seen people on, like, Instagram, they wear, like, silk scarves and they put them over their head and then they put their tops on to, like, like not get foundation on them so maybe maybe i'll do that but yeah it's a weird one i don't know why they've made it so like no one's got no one's got a head that small you know asos so um yeah not not too sure about this but I'm gonna keep it anyway so that is everything that i picked up from asos today i really hope you guys enjoyed this video let me know your favorite piece down below and i'll see you in the next one bye